Hey, what's going on, you guys? This is one of those, another one of those situations where it's, I really can't see the viewfinder on the camera, so I'm just trying to hold the camera like level and calm. What is that? Is that potted meat? Some sort of potted meat, and the top's been popped, but it's just sitting, it's just sitting here in this in this rusty um what is that a buggy a shopping cart we're gonna try and cross right here right now so anyway it's the 17th of january i think today is the 17th and it's uh 2023 and uh this is san francisco california it's about 67 degrees maybe just guessing and uh there is not really a cloud in the sky it's super sunny and warm and the waves look pretty good from up up a couple blocks up and so we're gonna go take a look at the waves and i have this another reason why we're just gonna go here for a second is because i have this uh my empty coffee and I just want to drop it in the trash. And when we're going to drop the coffee in the trash, we'll look at the waves real quick. That's about it. Like I said, it's absolutely beautiful. I can't see what you guys are seeing at all. So my screen is completely black to me. Wow, there's a big, let's, when we get up here, that's new. They, they posted a big no swimming sign at the beach that didn't used to be there. Let's go look at it. All right, so it feels like the storm, I haven't checked the weather really in a long time, in a couple days, so it just feels like the storm has passed completely to me. Uh, let's see, now the road is still closed. So the highway is still completely closed. You guys can see they have the great highway closed because of the well, see, Look at all this. So this is the ocean washing up over the freeway. Look at all this. So this would be presumably from high tide early this morning. It was breaking all the way up over here. Look at all that. I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, it's, it looks like it's all gone down. Wow, look at that big buoy. Wow, let's go down, you guys. So there's a buoy that washed up, it looks like. All the same stuff from uh, last week. Most of it has been cleared out. Well, no, I take that back. None of it has been cleared out. Look at it. There's still all this crap all over our beach. Wow. I've never seen it like this, you guys. So people were calling this a 50-year storm, and it really, it looks like it was. Because this is, there's none of this that's usually here. This is just sand, you guys. Look at it all the way down the beach. Wow, so people have made like uh, 
driftwood structures. Can you see that? A couple of them right there. Look at all this fucking crap. Excuse my French. Sorry, guys. It's just, this is a bit of a of a disaster, of a mess. This is messed up. It's going to take quite some time to clean all this up. So one thing that, that we did miss, and I haven't gone down the beach to check and see, but uh, about it's been about four days. So about four days ago, down the beach here just a little bit, down where the, uh, right by Robinson Crusoe's kitchen, right by Robinson Crusoe's kitchen, a gray whale brain casing uh, washed up, and it's huge. So it's a it's a whale skull, but it's not actually a skull. They don't call it a skull. They call it I think they call it a brain casing or something. I forget. Anyway, it's gigantic. So there was this huge, like six or eight foot tall uh, whale skull right down the beach that washed up, which I've never seen that anything like that before. So. It's nice to see the beach back to normal, at least with the uh, people are out here doing their normal thing. You know, working out, walking their dogs and fishing, and uh, it's just, this is a giant mess. It's gonna take a long time to clean up. I think the little structures that people are erecting is cool. Um, the bonfires are gonna be epic. I hope this has been viewable. ocean is so loud it's been so loud recently you can hear it through the through the windows you can hear the ocean even with the windows closed these days so here's where as I was mentioning the reason why this is such a big mess is I don't know how well the camera is going to show it up but there are tiny bits of see all the little bits of white there's little pieces of busted up styrofoam mixed in with all of this so there's there's broken uh, pieces of plastic and styrofoam mixed in to all of the plant matter. I mean, see, there's some sort of a little electrical cap right there. There's pieces of stickers and labels and all of it's got to go. It can't, I'm surprised it's all still here. I feel like it should have been removed somehow, but maybe it's still too early. I don't know, but see all this white stuff? This is all little bits of styrofoam that's going to all go back in the ocean it's just right here, washing all around for all the animals to ingest, and it really sucks. But I have a problem with this. I've had a problem with this for years. Uh, I'm, I've had a problem with them just letting people paint. Because, as you can see, what the storm has done is the storm has busted up against here and chipped off all this paint. So all of this paint, which shouldn't be here to begin with, it's now all into the ecosystem. It all chips off and ends up being consumed or mixed in with, with everything else. With the animals, mainly. The crab, because this is, a, this is a huge Dungeness crab beach. I think I've mentioned it before. You can, if you know what you're doing here, you can hand, cratch, hand catch crab. You can catch them with your hands if you know how the animal works and, you're, and you've done enough crab fishing, which I have done. So. You can, if you know what you're doing here, it's the, the animal life is ridiculous. You can survive off scallops and crab if you know where to go and how to catch them. But see all this? All of this paint flakes off and gets in all the animals. And it sucks. It, it, it sucks to me because uh, this place is supposed to be so eco-conscious and so progressive, but they won't step up and, 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 and help to preserve the environment. I think it sucks. Especially when, can you, when you consider how, how little of, of this is actual art. So some of it, very little a bit, like, like who is this? This is one of the Teen Titans or something. 
So this is kind of art, right? And this eyeball, it's kind of art. But all these tags, all these tags, this isn't really art. And these aren't really people, this isn't even people from my neighborhood. So what, what, what this is, is this is a gathering point, this spot. People from all over the city and outside of the city come here and party here at night and hang out. And that's what this is. This is not people that live here. This is people that congregate here and then they leave their mark. That's what it is. Look at this. I've never seen a buoy this size wash up like this, this far up. I don't know where this buoy came from, uh, whether it came off a ship or I don't know what, but there is crap everywhere, you guys. Look at all this. All right, that's probably enough rambling and looking at the, the trash on my beach. Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a great day.